Hello again, today I'm gonna show you a white Digicam in the snow. Let's see how good it is. So this is a Fujifilm FinePix T500 digital camera from 2013. It's a 16 megapixel camera with the 12 times optical zoom. That's impressive. So when you zoom the lens extend and you have 12 times optical zoom. That's fantastic for a camera of this size. It also has some uh, image stabilization. The zoom is controlled from here. Minus and plus. This is the LCD screen with a few buttons. It has a very small battery. It's a lithium ion battery. These are hard to find. They're not double A batteries which you can find anywhere. So they're more expensive. It uses a standard SD card. This is a four gigabyte SanDisk SD card. You plug it in like this. Battery back. This is a digital connector for USB to take photos out of the camera, but also I think it's recharging the battery. I don't know for sure. I don't have any cable with this camera. I just take off the battery and I use a standard universal charger with plus and minus connectors and I plug it in the wall. Simple as that. And I can charge any type of lithium ion battery. It says also here 12 times wide from uh, 4.3 to 51 millimeter the focal length actually from 1 to 12 times zoom this is the aperture 3.4 to 6.9 this is the flash a little light for the focus tripod mount right here on the side is just a, a place for the strap and uh, this is just a speaker for playback movie on the camera it also has a dedicated, this is the on and off button, and a dedicated movie button. So if you want to make a movie, you just press this button right here. And it started recording. Also, it's the best resolution in a photo and video of my <laughs> review, the Digicams, because a newer model, of course, it's over 10 years old, but you know, I like the, the old ones. This doesn't have a viewfinder, you just uh, rely on the screen. Before we take it out in the snow, let's see the shooting modes menu and what we have here. So here we have playback, arrows and other uh, classic flash, self timer. 2 and 10 seconds and uh, display information on and off not very clean it has fingerprints it's quite easy to to navigate the main modes are like this shooting mode auto program many many modes the classic modes and also a few others yeah, that's a lot of them. <laughs> uh, if you don't want to bother, you just use auto scene recognition. It's automatic. But you, you have a few missing options. If you use, of course, the program mode, you can choose anything from here. The exposure, compensation, plus or minus, light and dark, you know. The ISO value, image size, this is the quality and... Uh, we have another setup menu with the date and time and other language, you know, reset format, stuff like that. These are all the functions that you have. Okay, enough talk right here. Let's take it out for some uh, real life photos and videos. Now, I got my mic with me, so you can hear me. A self-timer shot. 10 seconds. I hope it took the shot. So cold. Yep. And one more with a little more zoom. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I got it. Actually, I'll take a video. 16 by 9 ratio. Now, you hear me only because I have this microphone right here 
connected to an uh, external recorder. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna fire the camera. If I miss it, it's okay. Okay, we'll see. Ooh. It, I missed it by that, that much. Now, I hope I don't destroy it. Yeah, good, it's good. So this is the video from the Fujifilm with the audio from here. Does it automatically focus when I'm close? After I started the video or not? Whew. Okay, I'll go inside. Finally, I can see some blue sky over here. I see a chamois, you know, the wild goat. The plateau. And zoom on the top of the mountain, 12 times. Okay, one more. And that's how we made fire. I'll try photo in the low light. Oh, it's quite nice with a flash. Okay, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>